What's up everyone? Let's take a quick tour of Cydia. I know a lot of people do not really explore Cydia all that much. All they do is really download tweaks and different applications. So let's head into Cydia here and just go through these options. So now once Cydia is loaded, you've got your Cydia on Facebook. Just select it and it'll take you right to Cydia's Facebook page. And you get the basic information about Cydia. And you've got the wall. And also you've got photos. Now you can head back and it'll take you right to the home page of Cydia again. And here is the Twitter feed of Jay Freeman, who is the creator of Cydia. Zurich and now let's head into the featured tab and the featured tab shows the top 10 tools to start with when you jailbreak uh, interface customizations and in these sections are different tweaks and applications that you can download here are the the basic tools a few of these I've already got. Activator is basically an essential. And when you go back and you got all these other options. Interface customization. All these tweak the, the springboard in its own way. And icon customization, mobile safari add-ons calling improvements, file managers and shares, screen extension options, and Cydia package helpers, and so on. There are more administration information down here, which you don't really need to worry about. Let's head out of here. Let's go into the themes. I'm not a big fan of themes. It really, to me, it slows it down slows your phone down a little bit with Winterboard. You've got your HD themes that would be used for the iPhone 4S and the 4 with the Retina display. And here are different modifications you can add to your home screen. Just select one and to download it you would just go to the package and then from here is where you can purchase the theme and also if it's free you can just go ahead and download it from this details page as well as sc different screenshots of the theme. Themes look nice but in my opinion they tend to slow the phone down a little bit. And also here are the standard definition themes and iPad themes. Let's head out of here and you will see each time you go into Cydia, these will change every once in a while. These are different tweaks. Now let's go into the Cydia store products. These are some of the best tweaks and themes on the Cydia store. All, all of these are paid applications. And some of these are really really su suggest you get like iFile and from here you can manage your account this is where a list shows all of your paid tweaks and applications in my case I connect with Google and I will type in my email and password here and once it's added you will sign in sign in. Now once signed in you will be able to select installable purchases and then once you're in there it will show your entire list of purchased tweaks and applications and from here you can go ahead and install or remove different tweaks. Now when this one gets done loading and you can uh, also 
select the change package and settings and you can show all changes. You can do this to any tweak. That way you can be updated on every update it gets even though it's not downloaded to your phone. Here are the updating jailbreak help tips and more package sources. These sources are have different tweaks packages inside them. I don't really download any of these. I just use the ones that are automatically added to the sources. Here are the sources. These are the ones that come with the jailbreak anyway. But if you want to add these, you can go ahead and install them. And down here are a couple of other tweaks. And here are the user guides. Frequently asked questions. You can go in here if you got a, a basic question in the in the fact area. Like what is Cydia and I installed something but there's no app and and so on. Fixing problems. There's different ways to fix different Cydia tweak problems. And you got copy files from the device and tons of other options here. You can go in, select them, and pick which ones you just want to look at. And down here at the bottom, it shows you the type of phone and your firmware. And you can also, up in the upper left, find the About button. Now here are the sections. These are all the folders that hold tweaks and themes and you can go in and select whatever tweak and theme you want to download. You can also edit this list by hitting the edit in the upper right hand corner and turning off different folders you do not use. This will shorten, shorten the list and make things a lot cleaner. Let's uh, take a look at the different changes. And here is the Manage tab. You select the Packages. These are all the packages that you have downloaded on your phone. And from here, you can also remove the tweaks from your phone. Let's head back out of here from Call Bar. It's not loading fast enough. So let's go back and find a new tweak. Let's go to Camera Grabber and you can hit Modify in the upper right hand corner and that's where you can remove or reinstall the tweak or application or theme. And from here, here are the sources that I stated before. To add one, you hit Edit in the upper right hand corner and then Add in the left hand corner and then you will select Add Source. Now that is a quick run through of Cydia. Obviously on the far right hand side is the search. You can search the entire Cydia for a specific tweak or theme. So again if you like this video hit the subscribe button above and the like button down below. I really appreciate you watching. Share this with your family and friends. Also like me on Facebook facebook.com slash Paul's iOS help and thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. This is Paul. God bless.